first time ever, mur murder hornets have been spotted in the U.S. They originate from Asia, and according to experts at Washington State University, the bees can be deadly if stung multiple times. The hornets cause the most destruction from midsummer to early fall. Not only can the bees attack humans, they also attack honey bee hives, kill adult bees, and devour bee larvae and pupa. If you spot a murder hornet, you should try. You should not try to go see it. Chris Looney of the Department of Agriculture says, if you get into them, run away, then call us. It is really important for us to know of every sighting if we're going to have any hope of eradication. In some other shocking news, Florida deputies have arrested a man who had been living in Disney World. According to Orange County Sheriff deputies, the man, Richard McGuire, said he'd been at the park since Monday and planned to stay for a week. Richard said he didn't know the parks were restricted and said that Disney looked like a tropical paradise. McGuire was taken to jail and arrested for trespassing. That's all for news this morning. man has been shot and killed in a shooting that occurred around 1130 yesterday. The shooting occurred on Crowley Street in East Syracuse. One man was taken to Upstate University Hospital with multiple gunshot wounds where he was pronounced dead. The investigation is still ongoing. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America. And to the republic for which it stands. One nation under God. Indivisible with liberty and justice for all. Hello ninth graders. This is Mrs. Ludwig, coordinator for college and career readiness with an important announcement. It's time for you to select your courses for 10th grade. The school counselors have designed a special Google site to help you with this task. Please make sure to check your English Google classrooms starting Monday, May 4th, and look for the assignment selecting courses for 10th grade. All the instructions and supports will be there to help you with this task. We need your help to build a schedule next year. So remember, log on to your English class Google Classroom, find that assignment, and complete it. Have fun! Hello everyone and happy Monday. Today is going to have some rain showers unfortunately, but tomorrow is going to have some cool sunshine with a high of 53. Unfortunately, Wednesday is going to have a high of 54 with rain showers in the late afternoon, but if you're planning on tanning at all this week, I definitely recommend doing it on Thursday because it will be the hottest day this week with a mixture of sun and clouds. And then Friday, Saturday, and Sunday will have a mixture of rain and snow showers with temperatures in the high 40s to low 50s. I'm Emily with the weather. The NFL has called off its international game coming this season due to the coronavirus. The game is usually held in London. The NFL also had a game scheduled to be played in Mexico City. Both of these will not be possible, but the NFL will be releasing their 17-game season schedule this week. I'm David with your sports.